I feel nauseous, believe me. Never had a lot of sh come easy. Had to work hard, struggle just to be me. Had to rise up just so they could see me. Did what I had to do just to feed me. And what was left over, I put towards my dreaming. So I decided to uh, do the, some mods for the GX460. This is uh, one of the first mod, but probably one of the best mod as well. OBD connection, all right. Okay, it's right here. That's where you're gonna plug that in right there. Right underneath there. And that's his head. Okay. This is what we should do. Let's see. Look at that. The GX four sixty doesn't come with that. But by doing that mod, now you got full power. There you go, first one of the best mod. These tabs right here need to get private a little open. Just keep this. We don't need it, but just keep it when we uh, might need to bring in for the uh, smoke inspection. We need we need might need to put it back on. Okay. Oh, yeah. Hi. This is a different angle. Let's see if that. this piece right here this what we need to get to to take it out it will uh, disintegrate over time it's not a matter if uh, if or when it will get disintegrate over time and it gets sucked in there and it will give the, uh, the dreaded four horsemen lights error and uh, make the truck go limb in the uh, limb mode so just take it out remove it throw it away one inch it. and uh, the reason I go with this brand instead of K&N is because this filter made in USA and it's only half a price of K&N filter 
So why not? Screw back on. Nut fit tight. There you go. And that was last you forever.